hi welcome back to my youtube channel my name is samantha nianzi and today's video is about how to make your own aloe vera oil i'm gonna take you through step by step how to make this oil so the first thing you do is you wash your own aloe vera you'll need like a half of the aloe vera so you wash it and then after you cut it out into small pieces as you can see what i'm doing there into like tiny tiny pieces and you put them in the bowl for blending and then you melt your coconut oil that you're gonna use later so you just need to press it like in the hot water bout for it to melt for later and you prepare your own extra virgin oil that you're gonna add in later so you're gonna need all this for later and now I'm gonna put my extra virgin oil in the glass for later as I had said now it's time to blend the aloe vera now it's time to blend the aloe vera as you can see and it's done then you put the pot on the cooker and you pour your aloe vera in and the coconut oil and the extra virgin oil as you can see and you keep stirring the pot for it not to stick like keep moving it otherwise it will stick on the pot and we don't want that so you keep stirring it, stirring it, keep stirring. You have to keep stirring until the oil turns um, a golden color as you can see, stunning. And as my oil was almost ready, I used a different oil which was the black custard oil, the Jamaican custard oil. You can use any other oil that you want to use, black seed oil, any choice of oil that you want to use. And then you're going to keep stirring again, girl, like keep using your hands until you see that color again. That golden color is going to come up like you need to make sure your oil turns that color, mm, that beautiful color. And then you leave your oil to rest for like an hour. You have to make sure that like it's fully rested. And then you use you use a strainer to strain to strain everything out. As you can see what I'm doing. I used like a legging because therefore I don't get any bits in, like everything was squeezed out, as you can see what I'm doing right there. So that they did a really good job. As you can see, everything was squeezed in enough that I used my other straightener, strainer to get everything out again. And this is the outcome of the oil. We've got our own organic natural aloe vera oil. There you go. It's so nice and beautiful. Thank you for watching my video and see you in the next one.